Hey guys, welcome back. And as you can see, engine is in. Side drive 40 Webers are connected. I made custom intake uh, bodies for them. And this week we'll be uh, doing the links and stuff to get it. With a rup rup. <laughs> also, did the exhaust manifolds today. As I said, one and four and two and three together, so it'll be one, four, three, two, and then going down past the new engine mount, one at the back, one at the front, going down there, and then at the bottom, running parallel to one another, splitting out the back to the side and to the other side. Also, going to do the block off plate still, busy with the remote water pump as i said in previous videos nothing on the front of the engine no pulleys nothing so basically as you're going to uh, it'll be as you see it here just a small pulley at the bottom to basically keep the front oil seal in check and then also to finish up the suspension links etc and uh, the new air intakes the carbon fiber intakes with the guide pipe to the discs so these are connected to the front end they're sitting a little bit further back now but the front clip when you pull the nose forward hence the guides there these two move forward by 30 centimeters so much more space to work on and easier access to the engine itself. Also, got to get a adapter made at the back to get the prop shaft onto the crank itself. And as you know, sitting on a alpha suspension with the alpha rear trans transaxle in it. And then also, also I've been uh, busy doing the suede on the seats you can see there quite cool I like the feel of it titanium frame of course and the headdress as well the headdress obviously being bolted to the frame itself so everything is basically now being test fitted so I still got to finish the tunnel there but everything being test fitted now so not too long from now <coughs> after I've finalized all the prep on the chassis as well as the body we will be going to paint I acquired the paint as well hydraulic handbrake the dash I'm also contemplating to put the dash into suede as well not to have as you can see glare from the aluminium itself and I might also go suede on the door panels, which is titanium. Um, yeah, and then there's the digital dash. Uh, we just took that out for some measurements, etc. <coughs> and uh, yeah, so we'll be getting there soon. And you can see the flywheel on the engine itself and the prop. So I'll just have to get a adapter to connect the two together. This engine obviously coming out of a front wheel drive platform, hence the uh, distributors in the back and not running off of a gear from the cam. Um, yeah, so we're getting there, slowly but surely, but getting there. And uh, when I say we, I mean I because I'm the only guy working on this, seeing as it is mine. I'm doing everything myself, as, I, as I've said in previous videos. And uh, yeah, taking a bit of time, but getting there. Also, I just want to say that um, keep at it. You have your dreams set. Keep at it. Push through. You will get there. Don't lose hope. I know I've been there countless times 
on various projects and life itself. Just keep on pushing through. You will eventually make it, even though at times days do look dark. Thanks for subscribing, liking, and commenting on this video. It will mean a lot to me. Thanks, guys. Check you on the next one. Cheers.